Uh, so good morning. Uh, uh, today actually we will start with backward difference interpolation. Uh, but before that uh, in forward difference uh, we need to have the error formula. We know the error formula for Lagrange and Newton's divided same that is error three types of error I discussed. So first two no problem true minus approximate by true first one second was as you uh, that p1 p2 p3 if you have that is practical error and the second actually was that error in interpolation error in interpolation so this for forward we will now develop for the forward difference interpolation formula error in interpolation we know that error in interpolation i can write as x minus x naught into x minus x1 up to x minus xn f n plus 1 t divided by factorial factorial 1 n plus 1 where this t is lying between x naught and xn this is our general error in interpolation formula okay so here for forward i am having the equispace points the nodes are equispace that means i have this x1 minus x0 is equal to x2 minus x1 dot dot is equal to some h that we have supposed and we know also while we are developing the forward difference formula we are, i had taken r as x minus x0 by h that means your x minus x0 is r h okay so x minus x0 is r h and while developing we also found that x minus x1 also it was r minus 1 h how you got that i got that as x plus x0 plus x0 minus x1 okay this minus and this x minus x0 is your r h and this x1 minus x0 i have taken the convention as h h so x0 minus x1 is minus h so this is r minus 1 h is it fine now from here if i substitute all these x minus x0 x minus x1 x minus xn up to here so uh, what i will get i will get x minus x0 as r h x minus x1 as r minus 1 into h and last term will be what for x minus xn it will be r minus n not n plus 1 see when it is a not it is h x minus 1 it is r minus 1 so x minus xn will be r minus n in the formula of interpolation we are having r minus n plus 1 because the coefficient here was x minus xn minus 1 understood so this is your r plus n h and into this f n plus 1 t divided by factorial n plus 1 fine so now you see how many h i have here how many h i have n plus 1 because from here it is 1 this is for not i have n points so i have h to the power n plus 1 this factorial n plus 1 and f n plus 1 t so this is now your formula for error in interpolation for forward difference interpolation fine where we know r where we know h okay and if only we have this function f t is given means f x there we will put this t as x naught less than equal to t less than equal to xn so we will get the error bounds lower and upper as you put x naught and xn depending upon what degree polynomial you want that means what are the nodes first and the last and so this will be the formula for forward difference interpolation okay now with this now we will switch to backward difference i had also defined last day the operators like nabla this f naught how we define this f of not minus f minus 1 fine if i want to define at f1 so it will be f1 minus 
f naught means one back. Okay, fine. So I have these backward difference operators like this. So if I want to write in general, it is nabla f i was f i minus f i minus one. Okay. So similar to the procedure that we developed for forward difference from the Newton's divided. Okay, we can follow the same procedure, but I need to have some relation between the backward difference operator and <coughs> divided difference. Okay. So here, if you see, if I have the Newton's divided difference between x naught and x one, how we define this? We already know. This is f one minus f naught by x one minus x naught. Fine. The denominator x one minus x naught will be your h because I have equispace points nodes. So the below one is h. And what is this f one minus f naught in terms of backward difference? Nabla f one, not the not in the in terms of forward, it is delta f naught. But in backward, it is nabla f of one. Understood? Now, if I want to write the next one, that means second order x one x two. So, what we'll get as per the formula for Newton's divided? What we'll do? I'll write in terms of first order x one x two minus f of x naught x one divided by x two minus x naught, x two minus x naught, and that is. That is 2h, 2h x naught x one x two. That is 2h. Fine. Now f of x one x two. If I want to write again in terms of function, what will get? F two minus f one by h x two minus x one. That is h. And that f two minus f one is what in terms of backward? Nabla f two. Nabla f two minus This term f of x1 x2, I have f of x1 x2 as nabla f1 by h. That means f1 minus f0 by x1 minus x0. That is your nabla f1 by h. Okay, fine. So that is nabla f1 by h. Both are having denominator h. This will make it 2h square. Here I can multiply with one factorial. This 2 is factorial. Okay. So what we'll get? Nabla f2 minus nabla f1. What I can write in terms of backward difference, second order. See, when I define this, I also define in the last class. If I want to write nabla 2 fi, okay, second order. What we had written, nabla one less order, nabla fi minus. F i minus one. Following this, what we'll have here? Nabla two f two. Nabla two f two. Nabla two f two by two factorial h square. Understood? So in this way, I can proceed, and you can use induction, etc. But the formula will come out to be what for n points? See, when up to two, nabla two, two f two. Two factorial, h square. Okay, when it is one, 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 h to the power one. Okay, so what we'll get in this procedure? You'll get nabla n f n divided by n factorial h to the power n. So I can have all the Newton's divided difference orders in terms of backward difference. Okay. Now only the left is just substitute this in the Newton's divided formula as we did for Newton's forward difference. You will get the formula for backward. So that I am skipping and I am writing now the directly the formula for Newton's backward difference. Fine. That will be so again. F x actually we are approximating by some p 
P n x nth degree polynomial approximated is equal to first term will be your f naught plus r nabla f I am not writing now naught okay okay let me write okay I will erase this actually it, okay in terms of f n it will be actually what is happening here you see I am getting f n f n means this is the last point as per your nodes x naught x1 xn and I told that when we will do backward we will start from the lower one. So, we will assume that that is not remember the x naught in forward and x naught in backward now are different different that is actually xn understood. So, it is just a notation ok remember x naught for backward is the last point I will show in the table also how it is done ok. So, that means I can write this f n as f naught and remember that is the last value of the function ok. So, f naught ok plus r into r plus 1 divided by factorial 2 nabla 2 f naught plus r into r plus 1. See this r plus 1 came from where? Newton's divided difference formula was first term f naught then x minus x naught f of x naught x 1 for x minus x naught I have r each ok that h is cancel you cancel out because nabla f naught by h is there understood. Second term I have x minus x 1 also and I know x minus x 1 is r minus 1 h eh sorry r plus 1 h here r plus 1 ok. So, that is why this r plus 1 is there ok. So, this r plus 1 up to r plus tell me up to r plus here it will be n minus 1 ok r plus n minus 1 into nabla n f naught and divided by factorial n. So, this is your formula and remember this x naught and f naught whatever is there those are your last point that means here this r is was in forward it was x minus x naught by h here is, is x minus x naught by h and remember this x naught is actually your x n for backward. Understood? I am writing that n as naught may be suppose n minus 1 as x 1 like that. So, now this is the r because x will be given near to the end points then only you will use the backward difference. So, x is the near to the end point x naught is the end point divided by h is your step size. So, x minus x naught by h is r accordingly you go depending upon your requirement what degree polynomial you need depending upon number of nodes you want ok fine. So, let us see now what is happening here during the table difference between forward and backward ok. So, I have this x I have this f and I have been given x naught x 1 x 2 x 3 and corresponding to these functions are f naught f 1 f 2 f 3. I need to have this So, I have been given this x and f are the nodes and the functions. I have four points ok x naught to x 3 f naught to x 3. I know how to develop the table for forward difference ok. So, I will write here i for means i this i is for forward. So, this is your 0 1 2 3 fine and i back means backward. So, I will write 0 here minus 1 minus 2 minus 3 only the notations I have not changed any data data is as it, as it, as it is ok fine. Now, I need to find the first divided first no not divided first forward or backward. So, first if you write this in terms of forward what you will do? this is your f 1 minus f naught 
this is your f2 minus f1 this is your f3 minus f2 this is forward okay now if i want to write backwards so forward means i am taking this notation okay let us now write for backward so backward is what this is actually f not f not minus f minus 1 okay you see if i subtract this from this the same number you will get na only the notation i am changing f not minus f minus 1 this will be what f minus 1 minus f minus 2 notation i am changing but the numbers are same is equal to f minus 2 minus f minus 3 so this is in terms of forward it is delta f not okay and in backward it is nabla f minus 2 only the notation but numbers are not changing that is my aim okay so here it is nabla f Minus one. It is here nabla f not. That is why I have taken nabla f not here. So actually nabla f not f not is coming from the last two points you are seeing. Understood? So now I can write the second. So that just I am showing that the computations are same. Only formula and the understanding of the backward difference procedure you have to little bit be careful. okay and now similarly i can write from here and here your second one so i am not writing that will be what nabla 2 here it will be nabla 2 this will be this minus this so this is nabla 2f not this is nabla 2f minus 1 and the third will be what from here and here and that will be your lambda 3 f not this minus this so see in the computations i am not changing okay so if you want to use backward so you will use this if you want to use forward you will use this this way and here for backward you will use these points okay if you have the forward you will use this and as per your formula that you have developed for forward or backward okay and moreover one thing more is that about x about x sorry as not a x that is r r in place of forward r is x minus x not by h i remember this is the first point that means this point for forward but for backward i have r as i am writing this x minus x not by h okay but this x not now is your last point okay so this x not is the last point so naturally this r and this r are different corresponding to your forward or backward you are using and the formula little bit change there it was r into r minus 1 by factorial 2 etc here it is r into r plus 1 r into r plus 1 plus into r plus 2 third term like that it will go okay so these are the differences between forward and backward same table you can use for both only the formula will change x that r will change don't use this r for backward you may get wrong answer fine <clears throat> now let us see about the error again error for backward so error for that another two types of error are that i have already told that is one that relative error and practical error same but here error in interpolation little bit again it will change compared to your forward so error epsilon n i had x minus x not into x minus x1 up to x minus xn into f of n plus 1 t divided by factorial n plus 1 okay i have x minus x not 
rather x minus x n in the backward x n is x naught remember. So, if I write now x minus x n as r h fine. So, x minus x n minus 1 will be what? x minus x n plus x n minus x n minus 1, x minus x n is r h plus x n minus x 1, x n minus 1 is h not minus h, h. So, I am getting r plus 1 h, the same procedure that is why here r plus 1 is coming, okay? r plus 1 h, fine. So, if I substitute all these, so what you will get? up to x minus x naught, you will get the same r h r plus 1 h up to r plus n, I am writing this here, okay? r plus n h into f n plus 1 t by factorial n plus 1. Again here how many h? n plus 1, okay? So, this is your h to the power n plus 1 by factorial n plus 1 r into r plus 1 up to r plus n. So, this is your error formula for backward only difference is this numerator. There it was r into r minus 1 into dot dot r minus n, here r into r plus 1 into r plus n. Rest all are same factorial n plus 1 h to the power n plus 1 h you know and f will be also there f n plus 1 t okay because functions derivative depending upon your what degree polynomial you are using those many derivatives okay plus 1 okay so the depending upon what n is so f n plus 1 will be there okay so that derivative so these are uh, backward difference so now let us one, take one example and see use Newton's forward and backward interpolation formula <coughs> to find to find j 0 x for x is equal to 1.72 by the given data by the given data. So, our function here is given j 0 x. So, I have to find j 0 x at x is equal to 1.72 fine. Now, the data are given as x i f i. So, x i are given as 1.7, 1.8, 1.9, 2.0 and here f i are given as 0 0.3979849, 0 0.3399864 corresponding to 1.9 I have 0 0.2818186 and last one 0 0.2238908. So, these are your data. Now, I have I for I back I for 0, 1, 2, 3, here it is 0, minus 1, minus 2, minus 3, fine. As per your convention, this is forward or backward. So, now forget about whether, whether it is forward and backward, just develop this table table development is this minus this, this minus this, this minus this. We do not bother whether it is forward or backward. When we will apply the method means formula, then only we need to see, fine. So, this, this minus this comes out to be minus 0 0.0579985 and this minus this is minus 0 0.0581678 and this minus this 
is your minus 0 0.057928. This is your first order. Okay. Second order will be from here and here. Okay. So second order is minus 0 0.000163. And here it is plus 0 0.000-2400. And the last one, third, the last one will be this minus this as 0 0.000-4400. Triple zeros four zero nine three. Okay, so this table I have developed without considering what what method you are using forward or backward. Fine. Now, if I want to use forward, so I told us in forward I have to use this, this, and this. That means I have to go like this. Okay. So here x is what one point seven two. At this point, I need to find a value of this x means what is f of this 1.72. Okay? So I can have this r as x minus x naught by h. So x is 1.72 and minus here x naught is 1.7. First point. 1.7 and divided by h point 0.1. And this comes out to be 0 0.2. Fine. Now I want to find by forward difference. Forward. That means J0 of 1.72. P3. Because I can go up to P3. Understood? This delta 3. First, second, third. So I can have the first term as F naught. That means 0 0.3979849 plus plus. As per the formula, it is R of delta F naught. R is your point two. Delta F naught is this minus point. 0 0.0579985 and plus other terms up to here that I am not writing you know last class I have done okay that will be r into r minus 1 into now delta 2 f naught delta 2 f naught is this and up to third term. So if I do this all this I will get the result as 0. 3864183. Remember, this is third degree polynomial result. I can have second degree up to second term. I mean second term means second order. That is third term. Second order, first line up to here. Okay. So all these degree polynomial I can get from here. So now if I want to have this exact value, you can see or you can compute the exact value of J0 at 1.72. This is your 0 0.3864185. So you see 3.6418 up to here it is matching. Okay? So how many significant digits? Six significant digits in polynomial degree 3 is matching with the exact. Okay? Although 7 D exact, 7, 7 decimal. Okay? So now let us use backward difference interpolation. Here, I told that r will change here because backward means our x naught now is this 2.0. Fine. So, x minus x naught by h, x is your 1.72 and minus x naught divided by 0 0.1 and this is your minus 2.8 minus 2.8 now if you use your formula for backward difference 
it will be your again p 3 here f naught here f naught will be what this guy not the top one in the backward difference. So, this will be 0 0.2238908 plus r nabla f naught r remember is minus 2.8 nabla f naught is your this this is your nabla f naught. So, I will have minus 0 0.0579278 and plus other terms r into r plus 1 nabla 2 f naught plus last term with nabla 3 f naught fine. So, I can have those from that table and after this simplification I will get the result as 0 0.386418. So, again you are seeing here up to 8 it is matching 6 significant digits. Fine. So, what you are seeing? So, using the third degree polynomial for this case 6 significant digit is, is matching for exact value up to 7 D because J0 also if you cannot find much means exactly numerically you can find. <coughs> so, if I have the exact value of this j 0 x at 1.72 this is the result. So, 6 degree 6 deci decimal or 6 significant digit is matching for forward and backward and you can see little bit change between these two results ok. Although up to 6 significant digit these are matching. So, if it is not given what formula you have to use just use interpolation formula. So, you can use any of them I am telling for your example. So, but if you have the large data size then forward and backward will be given different value depending upon your where that x is whether it is near to the beginning or near to the end. So, understood? So, in this way the same table can be used to find different degree polynomials using forward or backward interpolation formula fine. Okay, now, let us come to. So, now we will uh, see uh, the three operators, two operators already we have seen forward and backward mainly. So, I will write three operators, three or four operators. So, finite difference operators. First one is called shift operator this is defined as E of f x i as f of x i plus h shifting by h ok. Forward operator or forward difference operator operator this we know as delta f of x i as f of x i plus h minus f of x i. See I am now writing in terms of x i ok. Actually this is f of i. So, we know f of i is f i plus 1 plus i minus f i and f i plus 1 was actually what? f of x i plus h fine. Third is backward difference operator that is we know that is nabla f of x i and this is f of x i minus f of x i minus h one behind ok. Fourth is central that we discuss little bit only the operator I am writing here this delta f of x i as f of x i plus h by 2 half half of the width minus f of x i minus h by 2. So, these are the four operators I can have different relations between them that we will do in the next class ok. So, means connecting E delta nabla and this delta fine. So, these relations we will see in the next class and the proof also little bit small very 
uh, means uh, simple relations okay so each of them are having some relations between them so those will write in the next class and we'll try to prove those okay then we'll switch to spline interpolation okay thank you very much <laughs>